Hey, Wit here. I have a new storage unit behind me and I just uh, purchased it and I'm just gonna do a quick assessment tonight and I'm gonna let you guys get a sneak preview. So let's check it out. So here's the storage unit and uh, God knows what this thing is. I have no idea. Does it look like a some sort of uh, maybe AC type filtration type system thing. Just not sure. There's a crock pot and a few pieces there. Looks like the parts for the piece we're dealing with. It's a tarp here. Spray gun looks like for painting stuff. Sprayer. Some stereo components. Some sort of box here. This feels like it's probably closed. Toolbox, of course. I can see there's tools here. Some tires, not terribly happy about that. Um, but they look like they have some tread on them. Maybe they'll sell. Tools. More tools. More tools, some hooks, a little piece there. This is full, probably has tools in it. More tools in here, some basic tools. Uh, looks like a little voltmeter. That should get me some cash. And that's, I can see that's heavy down there, so that's gonna have tools in it. A little crawler. So, and then of course this piece here, I have no idea what this is. Looks like it could be some sort of, uh, I just don't know. Briggs and Stratton, I know that's a good company. Commercial design, cast iron sleeve. Diamond IC, commercial performance. I don't know. Trench digger, maybe? Maybe a post hole digger? I'm just not quite sure what that is right now. So, we'll come back to that. But anyways, I just wanted to give a quick assessment. And, uh, I see a helmet over there. Um, we'll get, uh, deeper into it. I didn't spend too much on the unit, so I should be able to make a profit from what I see in this unit. Thanks for watching. Not a whole lot of value here, but I'll bundle up uh, the small tools and sockets to see what I can get. And the wrenches I might sell on eBay. I was working in my office the other day and I thought, hey, I needed a solder gun, so this might work for me. You know, I can find value in just about anything, and these all these small stuff, they add up when you start selling them and putting them in different places for sale. So I feel pretty good about most of the stuff. This CD collection should work pretty nice. I'll list that as one piece, and just lots of miscellaneous things. The toolbox, some gloves. The gloves actually fit me. Uh, there's a picture of that uh, weed whacker again. I might find a battery for that. So overall, I'm pretty happy with this unit and I see myself unlocking quite a bit of value from all these different pieces. So yeah, I found a fishing box in there too. So um, if you see anything you like, feel free to reach out. I'd like to thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. If you uh, found some of this interesting i'm going to move on to another uh storage unit in a minute that i also bought hey wit here i have a storage unit that i just purchased it's the second one today and uh you can see behind me uh there's some boxes here so uh, let's take a look one of the things i noticed right off the bat was the box being crushed on that front photo So it's dark in here, and I'm not going to give uh, uh, too much content today. I'm just kind of giving an overview of 
some ideas of what I could be up against today. Looks like some drawers, possibly jewelry. So much for that. Glasses. Um, but, you know, we'll see what's in some of these a little bit later. Sometimes you just purchase on what you can see, and that's what I, I did. I have a light here that I'm assisting my iPad with. And this is mostly what you buy on. What, you're, what you can see is how you should determine what you want to bid on. Um, and then take, a, take some... Uh, educated guesses based on your history of buying units of what kind of units you like and what you might want to you uh, purchase and what you like to sell I personally like to sell on eBay so I like smalls I love boxes like these mystery boxes as they say in the trade and uh, I can see there's probably some weight crushing that bottom box so one or two or three of these boxes probably have books um, I see some Pyrex here. I know I can dish those off, so to speak. Pun intended. I see a rug down there. I see some, uh, what I think are like little fans or uh, possibly mini heaters, but most likely fans. I see some basically trinkets and junk in these boxes here. I see some mason bottles. So nothing terribly valuable there. The Instapot, who knows if it's actually in the box. It could be books. Um, but I see enough boxes here to make it interesting and worthwhile for me to have purchased and take a risk on for the price that I paid. Um, I see a desk here. Um, couldn't be terribly valuable. It might be a sewing desk. Hard to say. Um little file cabinet there um but we'll get into this and do some sorting and i'll let you know what's in it stay tuned on a future post thanks for watching This is another quick uh, footage video, just kind of trying to get some more details of stuff that might be around. Hard to tell, isn't it? Wish me luck. <laughs> 